All right, thanks a lot, Kristen. Well, all across the country on Thanksgiving morning, thousands of Americans get up early and do some running before sitting down and eating Thanksgiving dinner, including right here in the Panhandle. News for teens, Ethan Logue is in Walton County for the uh, annual 38 Thanksgiving Day races, which kick off in just a little while. And I noticed, uh, Ethan, a very large flock of geese uh, flying over your head a second ago. I guess they're heading south because it's too cold in Florida anymore. So, yeah, it's chilly. Yeah, great eye, Chris. We did just get a big flyover of geese. Actually, one of the race volunteers made a good analogy. He said that's kind of like our version of the Super Bowl flyover. I felt like that was a good comparison right there. And I got to tell you, I'm a little jealous of the people who are actually going to be running in this race since, like you said, it's pretty cold out. They'll be able to get the blood flow and get moving a little bit. The volunteers and the race organizers are the real heroes here. They're the ones who got to you know, brave the cold and really stick it out. So speaking of race directors and organizers, I have the co-race director joining me, Melanie Kane. So Melanie, again, for people who may have missed this a little early, Earlier this morning, what does this year's race map look like for the 30A 10K? So our 10K goes out. Everything starts here in Barrett Square. We have our starting point right behind us. Yep. We run from Rosemary. The 10K goes all the way out into Water Sound, almost to the Big Chill, and the turnaround comes back, and then they come right back to where the finish is. So it's an out and back. Okay. The 5K goes out out to the Water Sound Parkway, goes north on the parkway just a tiny bit and turns around and comes back. So everybody's down here cheering when they go off and then cheering when they come back. And then the one mile fun run, which is super fun for all the littles, mm -hmm. it goes straight out almost all the way to Alice Beach and comes right back. So good, very well structured, thought out map, nice and simple too. And I notice you got some things in your hands right here, some, I guess you could say some swag for all our race participants, correct? Yes. So everyone that signs up gets a race t-shirt as well as a finisher medal. Mm -hmm. So we have different ones for the 10K, the 5K, and the one mile fun run. Yeah, so that's, a, that's a really good looking medal right there. Now, how many people are participating in this year's race? So we have over 3,000. We are sold out in every single race category. So over 3,000 participants, plus all of the people that are coming to watch them mm -hmm. and support them. Because it's Thanksgiving Day and everything is for charity, a lot of people like to come out as a family. Mm -hmm. So there's lots of family fun activities for everyone around not only the runners but everybody that's here watching too. Absolutely very well said. Now really quick are there opportunities for people to come out obviously not participate but just come out and enjoy and cheer on the people running? Definitely. My one tip is to get here early because okay. parking is very limited, but there's um, plenty of things to do. We have lots of beverages and food afterward for all the participants. Okay. Um, there's lots of things happening in Rosemary in general yeah. because it's Thanksgiving Day. But yes, please come out and join us. It is our 12th annual year, so we're super excited. Mm -hmm. We've given over $800,000 wow. to local charities. We have some really fantastic charity partners this year. And then I want to have a big shout out to our volunteers. We have over 200 volunteers that help us put it all together mm -hmm. and we couldn't do it without them. So. so a lot of help and the actual race starts at 7:30. That's the first race when it kicks off. So just about an hour away from that. So like you heard Melanie just say if you are planning on a coming to attend and just to watch, get here as soon as possible so you can make sure you reserve your spot. Chris